good morning everybody it's like <clears throat> 9 a.m. and I just got up I have to come out and check on my ducks oh, I should have turned on the water first sorry about that don't turn around it's a lot of the who's back over here hmm. So we already have the hose hooked up up there to fill up the chicken, the duck waterer. And look at all the ducks already gathering around. Can't see it very well on the camera, but they are gathering. Also, we know for a fact that Super Croc has officially bred the triplets and ducky. Hi, Blueberry. She's a very good hen. And that Basilisk has officially bred George and Ducky. <coughs> so that one's George, that one's Ducky. And then all three of the brown girls are red. And they're all old enough to start laying eggs. As you can see, the triplets are starting to get their white feathers, and it's really hard to see in the lighting, but their breasts are starting to get whiter. Uh, showing that they're getting really, really close to being fully grown. And Junior over there has even more feathers coming in that I didn't even realize she needed to have come in. They're like right under there. That little yellowy streak like right there. And Ducky is just about fully grown now. But in they go. But yeah, none of them like being in the water while the males are in the water because that's the guy's favorite breeding spot. You know, and it's just normal for ducks to like the water more. So, they all sort of go in while the guys aren't in. Also, something that I've noticed. When Super Croc breeds with the girls the entire time, they're trying to get away with, from him and they're like freaking out a bit. But when Basilisk breeds with the girls, they're like totally chill. So I'm pretty sure it's because he's super nice to them. Whereas Super Croc just grabs them and is like, hey. But Basilisk is a nice duck. He goes up to them and... He's really sweet, and he like will preen their feathers, and uh, if Super Croc's being mean to them, he'll chew him away. He's a nice duck. He's earning their affection, whereas Super Croc is just like, yeah, let's, let's have some fun. Yeah, Basilisk is a good boy. And Super Croc's technically doing his job as well, so good boy. And Duck and Junior's the best girl. Junior, absolutely. <clears throat> Sorry, every morning, like, I have to cough a bit, you know, to wake up. But yeah, Junior is, like, the big mother hen, even though she's not as old. But see, though, that's her new feathers coming in. So, like, she will protect them all. One time, a uh, super truck tried to mate with her, and she literally just turned around and stared at him, and he quickly ran away. It was pretty funny. Blueberry. Good girl. Blueberry's just about our nicest chicken. She's got the biggest crest on her head, too. Come here. Ah, dang. She's also our smallest. Yeah, so we got all this hay from our very, very kind neighbors. Um, and the ducks and chickens absolutely love it because the bugs like to come up now and just rest in there. And then the chickens can scratch around and get even more food than they used to be getting. So thank you, friends. Since it's early in the morning, the boys aren't really doing anything. But when we come out here later in the evening, they're like constantly trying to mate with the girls. Uh, last time, Basilisk uh, beat um, Super Croc. Yeah, see, Ducky hides behind Junior and, and Basilisk. Because Super Croc's walking around. It's funny, if you'll notice that wherever he goes, she quickly runs away from him. Isn't Fred just gorgeous? She's my favorite out of them all. She's got her 
white wings. <laughs> Kelly's coming in. And there's Banana next to her. But she's just really, really pretty. The triplets should start their quacking a bit soon. But so far they've just been loudly peeping. Hi, Joel. Hi, Banana. Flappy, flappy. Oh yeah, it's super quack quack over there, so Jackie jumped in. She's yelling at the boys. Ducky has the prettiest tail feathers, too. She always has the cutest little butt wiggle. And her underwings are like solid white. George here and Fred are like super chill around the boys. As you can see, Fred's just walking right up to them. And Junior has zero cares in the world. See, though, they just sort of preen each other <laughs> and away she goes running. Ducky! And they're all looking at me weird. They're like, what the heck? Stop that. Every single time that a plane goes by, they all just stare up at the sky. It's really funny. Also, we had to completely redo all of this chicken wire up here because every single year when it snows, it completely collapses. Uh, the wooden supports are pretty good, but the chicken wire just busts open, as you can see right there. It does not hold like any weight whatsoever. And uh, this plating stuff that we have up there, we want to cover uh, that whole section too. I think we should just cover the entire roof. Chickens. Fluffy butt. Oh, Mrs. What's It? Hi. How are you, Mrs. What's It? Gonna run away from me. Okay, that's Black Beauty. Black Beauty is almost always super broody. Dang it, that rhymed. Hello? Sweet. Um, over here, by the duck house, literally none of the ducks have been using the duck house whatsoever. They don't care about it anymore. The chickens love it. Ducks have zero cares in the world for it because the chickens took it over. We had a hen who was out here laying her eggs in there, and we know that they weren't duck eggs because we keep track of what our, all of our hen's eggs look like. Or at least I do. I don't know about anybody else in the family. But since this is where all the ducks have been laying, if we find chick, if we find eggs under here, it most likely will be from them. Oh, all the chickens are all the ducks are running. Oh, that's why you're a child. But yeah. Look at them all go flappity flap flapping. All right, uh, Naomi, I gotta jump the water bucket. Could you hold this, please? Okay, keep it steady. All right. Okay, Ducky. It's now a swamp. And that is how you clean it out. Ah, dang it, now my hands are all dirty. Get up, just watch them. <laughs> oh, they're all running under the deck. Dang it. Alright, there they all go. I'm going back to the shed to paint. Okay, I see ya. Alright, so now that they're all under there, we just gotta wait for that to fill up. And then we can turn the power off for the water. Oh, wait, I have to clean out this one. Hi, Blueberry. This is their self waterer, and it gets super duper full of mud. really full. And every once in a while we deep clean it. Ugh. It is so hard to walk through that pen without like stepping in all of the chicken poop. All of our mint tea is growing really strong. It's supposed to keep the bugs away but they clearly don't care whatsoever. Oh and out come the ducks again now that I'm out. Wait did I shut that? I've 
completely forgot to lock the door. I put them all. They're all so cute. Alright, their water bucket's filling up. Over here we've got more mint, some lavender, oregano, climbing vines that we never asked for. This is our old chicken tractor. We used to keep them in here as as chicks when they were old enough to go out into the coop, but they hadn't met the chickens yet. Now they just sit there and get used to all the chickens. But now it's like super old and worn out and nasty. And then this is our old rabbit coop, which again, we don't use anymore. We're actually gonna give it to my big sister for her chickens that she's getting. And so over here, we're planning on putting in a big pond where that big pile of wood is. We're gonna move the fireplace over there and completely remove all those branches, use them up as fast as possible. And then we're gonna put in a 20 by 18 or something pond that's about three feet deep and we'll go swimming in it and stuff. It'll be nice. It'll be like three feet deep in the center and then it'll like sort of bowl shape out of it. Look at them all, they're all so cute. They just sit there munching on their water. You can barely even see what they're doing from in here. But Super Croc is in the water right now, and Fred is on the edge. Nobody's actually getting in with him. So yeah. Uh, I'm gonna head over here and show you guys what my sister and I have been working on. So we had originally been using our shed as a painting room. Then we decided to do an escape room for it, for our friends. But you know, so don't get weirded out by all the stuff we have on the walls. But yeah, this is technically our storage space. Scooch over, child. Ooh, gotta climb up this little ladder and scoop around. This is my sister's area. She's got... I let my friends paint on it. Her weird art. This right here, memorize this. This is a painting she did based off of a Bob Ross painting. The waterfall's the only good painting. <laughs> okay. And then over here is my wall. And this is my painting that I did off of a Bob Ross painting. The Bob Ross painting was going way too fast. Yeah, and then I did all these clouds. And a whole bunch of other stuff. Uh, but yeah, all the red handprints everywhere was because of us trying to... Make a Creepy secret escape room, room, escape room. So as you can see, yeah, that's from the escape room. We have all these little dots going up here. Oh, and Brody, I made a turtle. It's not a very good one, so I'll paint a better one in this blue one. But yeah, I have all of these little spaces that I'm gonna put something in it. And as you can see, I've already put in this wave. I like it a lot. And here, I painted a rainbow in pastels. And this orb, I'm gonna do a planet right there. And I'm trying to paint Bikini Bottom from the back. Except it was, it was Except from I have the back. Absolutely if it was from the no back, Peter, then the what, would have to be on the other side. Except I have absolutely no idea what Bikini Bottom looks like. I don't care, child. Cause you did, you it's because I was originally going to do it facing like normally, but then I was like, oh wait, I don't know how to paint anything. As you can see, our paint pal palettes are nasty. Filled up with dried, crispy paint. And these are my brushes. I, we don't... Nah. I haven't been washing them because, you know, it doesn't really matter in here. It's kind of crispy. I've got all these paint brushes. This is like the only nice thing that I own. And it's this art box that I got at DI. But it yes. A it's kind of a so, this is stuff that my friend wrote about me. I mean, I wrote about my friend and then she wrote that about me. But yeah. This right here is a little symbol means that you always remember them. Also, I painted this. Yo! What? Why are you in the What is the baby? We're taking care of the ducks! The is a humongous I'm videoing. And the, they keep on pushing them. Yeah, and they keep on pushing them. Ah, my sisters are the best. Do not block it. Yeah, so we got this little shed. And this is what my sister's been working on. I don't know remotely what it is. I'm pretty sure that's Patrick's turn. I have no idea. She's got a nice 
a pineapple drawn on there. Also, she's like, she said, what should I write on this? What should I paint? And I said, yes. And then she's like, all right, what color should I do? And I said, yes. So she did a rainbow. And she's like, all right, what color should the words be? And I was like, yes. And, and she's like, black or white? And I was just like, yes. So she, yeah. It was originally going to be gray, but then she just chose to do black. Here's her paint palette mess. She has more paints than I do at the moment because my sister keeps giving them to her, which makes me sad because I'm the one who uses them. This is a painting that she did when I did my wall. It's pretty nice. I did that comment. I also did that moon. But I like my moon more. Alright, so. I have... Hello. No idea how close or zoomed in this is because... I'm holding my iPad backwards at the moment, so I cannot see the screen. But yes. Um, child. All of the children try to come in here. Do not mind the big leaves from pine trees. Are you in? Over there. I said there was a camera. I'm going to be taking lenses out every time. All right. While. I'm heading out now. And you get to wash them, because Mom said you had to. Great. I'm also taking care of the ducks and doing my video. All right, so let me hop down here. Ah. Yeah, so this is our ladder we have to climb up. All right, I gotta turn off the duck water. So yeah, that's my video for today.